Good morning YouTube friends, it's Rena, and I'm coming to you with a project share today that I created to keep myself. I don't often do that, but this one's definitely for me and my craft room. Um, this is the gold birdcage that I showed you in my haul um, last week, and I hope you can see it. So it's not gold anymore. It's white. And I thought a lot about this project and whether or not I wanted to texturize the birdcage with the paint and sand um, technique. And I decided that I didn't because I wanted it to be shabby chic, but I just didn't want to go that route with this particular project. Um, <clears throat> so... I did take my inspiration for this from Faith Chick 777 and Bonnie at Saucy Scrappers. Um, they both have a couple of beautiful altered bird cages. And um, let me start at the top. So, up here, you know, obviously I spray painted everything white. And I use this beautiful bling trim from um, the One Little Dreamer Zibit Shop. This, uh, the fibers up here are to add a little shabbiness to it, but it's actually holding up the photograph that's inside. So <clears throat> I, I picked up some flowers um, the other day at Hobby Lobby. And I actually the white ones were from Hobby Lobby and the pink ones are from Joann's. Just to be clear, <laughs> um, I added some feathers throughout. So there's pink and white feathers. And then I added these two beautiful birds that I got at Hobby Lobby. And they're both white and glittered and their feathers are curled and very pretty. And they're looking at each other. And then as right as you come down underneath, um, this is a metal piece I got at Michael's and the sentiment inside says if love was water I'd give you the sea and I absolutely love that sentiment um, so I wanted to use it on this product pro project um, I added this little key here and then I draped some pearls throughout the flowers and then as you come down <clears throat> um, this is the beautiful lace that was given to me by my friend Letty. Thank you so much, Letty. I love that lace. And I added a row of uh, the bling from the One Little Dreamer shop. <clears throat> and before I forget, these appliques here, and they're on every corner of this project. Um, let me show you there and also back here. Um, is from uh, Lavish Laces. So pretty. I'd never had an applique before and I loved it so I'm going to be getting some more. Um, this is a wood piece from Kaiser Craft and I painted it um, white and gessoed it and that is definitely inspiration from um, Linda Faith Chick 777. She had that on her project and I just loved how it looked on the birdcage. Um, so I have my, my flowers all throughout the inside of the cage and there's feathers back there and there's a little bottle with pearls in it and then the bird, cage, or the bird nest with um, the glittered eggs. And then um, this is a Michael's wooden frame <clears throat> and I printed our picture and I have I have an area where I save acetate uh, for my mini albums and so I used that on the front of the photo and I added this beautiful bling heart from the DIY boutique supply there and there and then I added this um, off the charts key that I think I got at Saw Crafters. Love it. So. This is very, very similar to what um, Linda did on her channel where she hung the photo on the inside. Only hers is a clock and mine's not. Um, it's just the photo in there. 
and I just love it. Thank you, Linda, for the inspiration. Um, so over here on the door, I forgot to mention that I added this lock. Um, also, I believe from Saw Crafters, and um, this is actually the key that goes with that lock. But I love this key. So um, I put the heart like this is the you know the uh, my heart. And this is the key, and I put it next to my husband in the photograph because he holds the key to my heart. So that was my thought there. Um, down here I have a beautiful um, butterfly, from, also from Saw Crafters. And then I added tool um, coming out throughout the project. Um, I am not, it's on a base, but I'm not keeping it on a base. My husband is actually going to... Um, up there on the ceiling very high he's going to put a hook and bring a chain down so that sorry about that light so that it will hang right next to my dress and that's where it's going to go so that is my project i am in love with it um oh i didn't show you at the bottom at the bottom i use this pretty fringe um, and I got, I just get this at Hobby Lobby. And then I layered that beautiful lace that Letty gave me all the way around the project. So, Letty, thank you so much for that lace. It is just gorgeous. So, there you go. Um, I hope you liked it. I am so in love with it. I can't wait for my husband to come home today and hang it up for me. All right, everybody. Have a happy scrappy day, and I'll be back real soon. I'm going to do a room tour here in just a few minutes. Okay. Bye-bye.